and we have started the process uh, the, the process of even effecting arrest and uh, you see what we are dealing with like the uh, Paris has said we are investigating homicide the homicide kid right we are looking at the immediate what are the immediate facts of that we could gather in number of them say oh this thing led to the death directly and this person played a role in it then we look at the remote like we said we will explore the impact of all the experiences that uh, this young man had which was have considered some level of uh, psychological emotional so, torture that pushed him into changing the standard behavior mm -hmm. and how it's impacted on his later, later part of his life. So we are looking at all this and everybody to be remotely connected or directly connected, we have listed them out, we are establishing contact with them. And I said it the other day that even if the person is out of the country, the somebody with free conscience needs no fear. So if you accuse me, I see no reason why I should run away. And uh, so, if they say there's an allegation against you, you made a name nationally and internationally, you have a choice. Come and clear your name and move on. If you refuse to do that, you have options. The first option is to declare you want it. And that will certainly be done if those personalities that we have identified refuse to hold our Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The second option is to deploy our interpol troops. And wherever you are in this world, that is why we have the interpol. We will definitely get you back to answer for the criminal allegations against you. So for those of you, you are close that down there, if you have contact with them, is to encourage them. They have an option to destroy their uh, image internally or to come and play. But to keep running, the further they run, the faster we run after them. Thank you. 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 Thank Sorry? Can we please keep the public informed of all of these steps? So I appreciate that you're going to do X, Y, Z. We're, we're professionally and legally permitted. If we do, and it has no legal implication, it will also not impact on the, it will not jeopardize back, back our investigation. It will not be in public interest to even see. Okay, if I want to go and arrest somebody tomorrow, now I have information. I'm sure you will not expect that I should come and say tomorrow I'm going to. But the ones that the progress we make and that is safe to present to the public without uh, frustrating or impacting negatively on what we're doing, please, please respect that we are doing it for the overall. Don't take it as if we are considering. Okay? But we'll be open, we'll be accountable. That's all and, I want. But, yeah, we will. Witness protection. Uh, this issue has come up again, so I think uh, right now the DCOPS. The DCOPS, the OCSID, should immediately now extend the police protection to the families of the deceased. Immediately. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to mention names. You mentioned the names of those uh, questions. We have wider co compilation. And like I said, we have officially written to all of them, giving them dates to report, and that if they fail to meet that deadline, we declare them one. It is written clearly. Yeah, because uh, because uh, uh, our people will be mentioning the north, the people that were there. So, uh, sorry, the guy was, you know, in okay, the name of language. Sorry, sir, I just want to clarify something. 